joining us this evening. It's a real special evening, a lot of different accounts and different reasons. But I think what makes this, makes this show so fun is that not only is it pop surrealism that we're enjoying tonight for the better portion of the gallery, we also are getting a moment in time to sort of celebrate a number of different things. One being that uh, Michael Summers recently signed with Crown Thorn Publishing, an international distribution agreement. And the beauty of that is that Crown Thorn Publishing has discovered three obscure artists and taken them to national and international acclaim. So I think that if Crown Thorn Publishing has signed Michael Summers, I think they have another star in the midst. So, Michael, congratulations. And it just so happens that Crown Thorn Publishing is our sister organization. So exclusive collections, art galleries, as well as Crown Thorn Publishing are two separate companies, but for all intents and purposes, um, I get the good pleasure of sleeping with the uh, president of Crown Thorn Publishing. <laughs> Another thing that I'd like to make mention of that I think is really wonderful is in keeping with that international distribution agreement, at least on a national level, I know that Ruth Ann and I have turned down, Michael, don't get upset, but we've turned out dozens of galleries over the past year that would really love to represent Michael's work. One of the reasons, or one of the many reasons, we haven't entered into relationships with other galleries with Michael's work is primarily because we really feel that he's a fine art artist and he really deserves to have the absolute best representation, at least nationally, if not internationally. So with that said, we're very excited about the fact that there'll be a gallery in mid-February to the third week in February at Caesars Forum Shops, the highest volume retail sales environment in the entire world, will be representing Michael's work. So.